so hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing great so in this video i'm going to show you how you can create this crush the cane animation in the blender with the help of the software simulation so without any further delay now let's get started tutorial so first of all i'm just going to open my blender so here you can see guys this is the same project file which is i shown you before and this is the same animation if i play the animation here you can see it will look like this okay so for making this this kind of animation you need uh, one model something like that and i have downloaded this cane model from the blender kit you can download this blender kit add-on and that will be free to all you can use it okay and now i'm just going to start a file then we'll discuss how we can create this animation okay so let's do it so here you can see guys here we have a one brand new file and now i'm just going to show you how you can create this animation so for creating this animation you need one object which is going to press this and which is going to crush this cane for making this model i'm just going to add one cylinder here pressing the shift a and going to add the cylinder and i'm just going to little bit scale something like that and keep it little bit upside okay and now i'm just going to my camera view and i'm just going to lock my camera view for a while yeah i think that's look fine we can keep it here okay and maybe we have to just uh, do a little bit zoom in out and little bit something like that yeah that's look fine okay so now i'm just going to scale this uh, cylinder pressing the s and z i think that's fine we can do a little bit more yeah that's fine okay and after that i'm just going to edit mode of this cylinder then i'm just going to select this bottom face and going to extrude it then i will just going to scale something like that then i'm just going to extrude it once more so i think that's look fine to me and we can add the bevel on it yeah now it's looking more smooth okay so first of all i'm just going to set this scene uh, something like that i think that's look fine yeah and keep this cylinder to little bit up yeah so now i'm just going to add the animation on this cylinder okay so for adding the animation i'm just going to press the i I'm going to click the lock location so here you can see guys here we have a one new frame now i'm just going to switch my 38 frame and then i'm just going to uh, enable my auto key so which is going to create an automatic key according to our uh, object uh, movement so now i'm just going to move this something like that i think that much fine to me okay then i'm just going to my 50th frame and going to copy this frame pressing the control c and then i'm just going to paste it control v okay and after that i'm just going to my 70th frame and copy this first frame pressing the control c and control v okay that's look fine to me but here is one problem so we have to just little bit uh, extrude this part upside yeah i think this look yeah that look fine to me okay so here you can see if i will play the animation so it's gonna down then it's gonna up again okay so now we'll add the simulation so before adding the simulation make sure to disable your auto key so now i'm just going to add the collusion on this plane first of all so for adding the collusion i'm just going to switch my physics tab and here you can see we have a collusion i'm just going to add the collusion and you don't need to change any setting just keep it by default and same thing you have to do with this pressure as well just going to add the collusion and leave as a by default okay so after that i'm just going to select my cane and so now i'm just going to add the soft body simulation on it and then i'm just going to open my object settings and here i'm just going to set this mass value 0 0.5 okay that's it now i'm just going to close this and after that make sure you uh, uncheck this goal and then you have to just uh, open your edge settings and from here you have to change some settings going to keep it uh, 0 0.96 okay so you can use these values on your project as well okay now i'm just going to set this 0 0.9 and then i'm just uh, increase this plasticity to 100 and enable this bending to the 10 okay and after that you don't need to change anything you have to just bake your simulation so first of all you have to go your cache setting and from here you have to uh, save your file first of all i'm just going to save this file pressing the ctrl shift s i'm just going to keep it this name zero crust yeah something like that okay and after that you have to just click on the bake before doing the bake make sure you define your end frame so now our end frame is 150 and now i'm just going to bake it so 
so here you can see guys our baking is done and now i'm just going to show you the animation so here you can see if i will play the animation so it will look like this so here you can see so that cane is going to crash very nicely here you can see if i will show you the another view so it's gonna crush very nicely so that's how you can crush uh, the cane in the blender with the help of the soft audio simulation not a cane you can crush anything whatever you want to crush okay and now you have to just add the material on this uh, object as well you have to just add a new material and increase the metallic value to one then you have to just decrease little roughness so it will look more metallic here you can see and now you can just add light in your scene and you can add the camera and you can hit the render and after that you will see the animation something like that so that's how you can create the crush the cane animation in the blender with the help of the uh, soft audio simulation so thanks for watching this video guys if you learn something in this video please hit the like button hit the share button and subscribe my channel also if you have any queries please let me know in the comment box i will definitely reply your comments so bye bye take care and stay home guys